The competition in the midsize segment is bigger than ever, with manufacturers like Toyota, Chevy, and Ford competing for the most sales. Every manufacturer has a good challenger, but the latest Ford Ranger is definitely in a league of its own. The model, now entering its second production year, is getting feistier than ever, with many upgrades coming for the 2025 model year. So if you want to learn how Ford is planning to surprise us, stay with us while we cover how the all-new Ford Ranger wows everybody. Platform and Configurations Now let's start with the core of the Ford Ranger, which is the platform and the available configurations that you're able to choose. The Ford Ranger from 2024 is not the same as the previous model. The previous one was a Ford Ranger dedicated to the European market, but from 2024, this model is designed to be a proper American model. So this new generation features a revised frame. Dubbed as the T6.2, this new frame brought many new changes that allowed Ford to adapt this truck for the US market. This new platform features 2-inch wider tracks and an all-new suspension setup that was placed outboard. This allowed for more spring and damper articulation, which allowed for the handling capabilities to be improved under serious stress, such as towing and carrying a heavy payload. For 2025, this frame will stay the same, since this is a rather new model that is in the early stages of its life cycle. But what is interesting for 2025 is that we'll see some changes in terms of the configurations. Many buyers showed their dissatisfaction with Ford for the lack of available configs. The 2024 model only came with a crew cab and a 5-foot bed. This isn't what many buyers want. Many need an extended cab and a longer 6-foot bed. So reportedly, Ford will finally listen and for the 2025 model year, they'll release a smaller extended cab and a longer 6-foot bed with a Ford Ranger. This will make many of the small contractors who need that extra bed space to carry tools, materials, and other essentials in their pickup truck extremely happy powertrain options powertrains are vital when it comes to choosing the right truck for your application you need a powerful engine to satisfy all your needs this is why you should choose wisely when it comes to the ford ranger it's worth noting that this model has a whole palette of engines basically the most diverse lineup in the midsize segment with three different engines available to choose from the base engine is the 2.3 EcoBoost. This is a small inline four turbo engine that's built like a tank. This engine is the standard engine, which means that you don't have to pay extra for it. The 2.3 engine produces up to 270 horsepower and 310 pound-feet of torque, which is plenty of performance from this small engine. The second engine in this lineup is the 2.7 liter EcoBoost. The 2.7 liter engine is a turbocharged V6 engine that produces up to 315 horsepower and 400 pound-feet of torque. And honestly, this is the engine that we recommend buying. It produces massive amounts of power and with this engine, you'll never have any trouble when it comes to towing. The last engine available in this model is the 3.0 EcoBoost. This is also a V6 turbo engine. The 3.0 EcoBoost is only available with the top trim, which is the Ranger Raptor. This engine produces massive amounts of power, which is 392 horsepower and 430 pound-feet of torque. Easily the most powerful engine in the whole lineup. All three engines are confirmed to stay for the 2025 model year. This means that there will be no changes in the existing lineup. However, there is a chance that we'll see a diesel variant. There's a diesel engine available with the Ford Ranger in Europe. So we could expect this diesel engine to become available here in the US. This 3.0 power stroke is known as the Lion and was already available with the Ford F-150 in the past. This engine develops up to 250 horsepower and 440 pound-feet of torque, which is a massive performance. So we strongly hope that Ford will finally listen and bring this engine back to the US market and make many buyers extremely happy. Plug-in hybrid version. Another thing that will make a lot of buyers happy is the ability to get a plug-in hybrid model. That's right, the Ford Ranger will come with a plug-in hybrid version for the 2025 model year. The plug-in hybrid is already in the works and it should be introduced this summer. This model will feature the 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine that will be paired with an electric motor and a medium-sized battery. When it comes to power figures, things are still unknown, but it is expected that this model will make power somewhere in the 350 horsepower range. But since this is a hybrid, power should not be your top priority, but instead the real advantage of this model will be the fuel economy. This model will deliver up to 30 mpg combined and most importantly, a good electric only range of 27 miles. This means that you'll be able to drive in EV mode and get excellent fuel economy. On top of that, you'll also be able to use the battery as a power source. This will allow you to plug in all your power tools and use this truck for work. You can even power your own house from this truck. It can't get any crazier than that. Towing and payload capacity. 
Towing and payload play a vital part when it comes to choosing your future truck. A truck has to deliver both in terms of payload and towing in order to be considered a good purchase. Luckily for you, the Ford Ranger is a fairly good performer. This model can tow up to 7,500 pounds and take a payload of 1,860 pounds. This tow rating is only 200 pounds shorter than the Chevy Colorado, GMC Canyon, and Jeep Gladiator. All these models can tow up to 7,700 pounds. But for 2025, there will be surprises. The new model year will bring a plug-in hybrid version. This will result in a boost in the towing capacity. So the new 2025 model will be able to tow up to 7,770 pounds, which is basically the new benchmark in this midsize category. That's why if you're after a capable truck for towing, waiting for the 2025 model year is a no-brainer decision. Fuel Economy Fuel economy is another very important factor that until recently was not considered at all. But with the rise of gas prices, more and more buyers become aware of this and they try to find a vehicle that will deliver excellent fuel economy and will save them a few bucks at the gas station. Luckily for you, the Ford Ranger is definitely one of the best models when it comes to fuel economy in the mid-size segment. Ford offers a variety of different engines with a Ranger and this is why this model has a competitive edge over its rivals. So the 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine will give you 22 MP combined, while the 2.7 liter EcoBoost will give you up to 20 MPG combined, and the 3.0 EcoBoost in the Raptor will give you up to 17 MPG combined. These numbers are expected to stay for the 2025 model year, but there will be some improvements with the introduction of the plug-in hybrid model. This new model is expected to boost the MPGs up to 30 combined with a 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine. This will make the Ford Ranger plug-in hybrid the king in this mid-size segment. Also, this model will be able to squeeze up to 27 miles in EV mode alone. So if you drive short distances, you'll not even have to power on the internal combustion engine at all. Exterior and Interior Changes when it comes to the exterior styling, there will be no major changes for the 2025 model year of the Ford Ranger. This is the case because this model is only a year old, so there's no reason for Ford to invest heavily in revising the exterior and interior of this model. We can expect more upgrades when it comes to styling in the upcoming years as this truck will start to show its age. However, there can be new exterior colors with the 2025 Ford Ranger. These new colors should be unique to this model and bring a small refresh. Trim Levels the trim levels are also expected to stay for the 2025 model year as well. These trim levels include the XL, XLT, Lariat, and Raptor. However, there can be an addition to the lineup. This new addition can be a separate trim level for the plug-in hybrid version. But time will tell if we're going to see this trim or if the plug-in hybrid will simply be added to the standard lineup of trims. Pricing and Release Date when it comes to the pricing of this truck, we could expect a small discount over the current version of the model. The current model starts at $32,670, which is quite steep for a mid-sized truck, so it's expected for Ford to reduce the price a bit and make the model more competitive. When it comes to the release date, it's expected that this model will be introduced this summer and the official release to be at the end of 2024. Thanks for watching and see you next time.